Hey guys, Tanner here with our very first Arc Knights video. I decided to do a reroll guide before making a first impressions video since that's what day one players are looking for. This game has been hyped for a very long time. In fact, it was so long that I'm actually not as excited initially, but still excited on launch day like many of you. Just know that Arc Knights is another game you do fine without rerolling. Since I heard there's actually no PvP so, but it's fine. I get it. I'm a reroller myself, so I understand because I'm gonna reroll too, and therefore this video guide, okay? And I'm gonna go through the whole process with you guys as usual. I feel like my guide is more like an idiot's proof to rerolling since you kind of visually see where I'm going and how I do it step by step. So let's go. Also, for some reason, everyone has been panicking on Discord because for some reason they couldn't reroll with the normal way of doing so by clearing data, which I've just tried and it actually works. I've actually spent quite a lot of time for the past hours trying the various methods suggested by Discord users. So I'm gonna show you guys in this video. Once again, I'm using an emulator on PC, specifically LD players. So if you're using iOS, I am sorry once again, you gotta find out yourself. But the usual method, clearing cache, clearing data, data or reinstalling the game usually clearing data or reinstalling the game works okay so first up where to download okay let me go to the home okay uh, i've used a uh, q app okay so if you're one of the lucky countries and you have it in your play store or app store good for you don't have to let us know just reroll and enjoy your game okay now for the rest of us that wants to play but not available in your play store or app store okay i'm in singapore for that matter okay i downloaded this game via q app so use that to download oh it's actually on the home screen right now it's, it's, it's been hyped okay so use that to download you can probably download it from other third party store like apk as well okay so on the home screen you are greeted with some login options that will bind the game to your social media account or your start account let's start with the guest account i've already done so and i actually got out okay so the social media options are facebook twitter and your star so I would start by using the guest account. So, okay, so we greeted by this screen. Okay, so for name, okay, just three. So for name, I'm gonna use 10 a time. This is like, I don't know how many time I'm using. So I believe the names are actually tied to the account number. So it's not unique to the server. So don't worry about it. However, you can't change your name after entering. Also, I heard, okay. For the sake of this video, I actually have not read or watched the story. But I will after uploading this video. Rushing this for the sake of you reroll boys, so you guys can watch this and reroll in peace. Yeah, we're probably gonna spend I don't know maybe a day or two rerolling. I'll try not to reroll for that long, cause I wanna catch up with the game and you know make some content for this game as well. Maybe I have not decided, so I'm just gonna speed this thing up. Okay. Okay, so I know there are other reroll guys out there, but they're not as what I call dummy proof as this one. So okay, let's move on ahead. I'm gonna fast forward this process and. I'll see you guys later. Okay, keep that. Okay, don't forget that even in tutorial, you can actually speed things up a bit. So be sure to do that when re-rolling. It's gonna save you a ton of time. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so we're gonna do our first uh, one pool uh, tutorial pool. So I think I think you can actually get a six star from one of these, but counts as a uh, guaranteed six star from your newbie pool. So okay, after this, it's usually guaranteed four star and above. So then go put it in. Okay, this is Operation Zero One. This is where you actually uh, skip and then quit the story, retire. I don't know what you call it. Okay, so you can actually uh, 
Retreat. Okay, retreat from the operation. I'm pretty sure there's a reason why they call the main character Doctor. Sounds kind of weird, but okay. So we gotta collect all your rewards. But actually, for rerolling, uh, the only the only important reward is actually in the mail. So we just need this actually. It's just gonna collect all, okay. Okay, so Savage is a guaranteed 5 star available for you as a reward. I'm gonna do the newbie pool here. Uh, you can actually um, accumulate uh, 6,000 gems to do this. Okay, in this uh, raid up banner, you can actually get units that are not in the newbie summon banners, which is the discounted raid. I believe they are the 6 star like Ifrit, Ajahala, Nightingale, and Saria. So the rest of these 6 star operators are actually available right here. As you can see right here, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We're gonna do this one for our reroll, okay? So this is what you're gonna do. Gonna, gonna do the reroll. I really like the reroll. You know, kind of just unzip the human resource. I don't know. I kind of like human resource. Okay, sure. Okay, keep this a bit. Okay, this calm is actually really good. So in this uh, discounted rate, you're gonna guarantee you're gonna get a guaranteed uh, 6 star and a guaranteed 5 star within like 21 pulls. So the first 10 pulls, you're gonna get a guaranteed 6 star, which is amazing for rerolling. Even the 3 star can be pretty cute actually. I really like the character design of this game. Do this. Oh, Angelina! Okay, she's actually the worst. The worst 6 star of the 6 lot, but it's actually my favorite. This is like, you know, my waifu. I'm probably gonna keep an account with Angelina or something. But I'm actually aiming for at least like 2 6 stars. So I'm actually hoping for 2 6 stars in an account. So this is not the one that I want. So I'm just gonna give this up. Okay, so we don't have what we want. So we're gonna go to home screen. So there are actually various methods uh, suggested by Discord users. There's this one with the email. You can actually bind the email. For some reason, I don't really know how that works. So you actually have to create a Yostar account. Okay, so example, tannertime at gmail.com. All right, so I would do this. Okay, but actually this name is actually taken. It's not my account. So you're gonna send a verification code to your email account and then you verify it and then you do your guest account okay so the next time you actually want to reroll you have to do this again but uh i don't actually know how that works but it's supposed to be able to just add one and then you can buy in it i couldn't figure how that works and it's kind of a waste of time for me I know this might be actually be the fastest method to reroll, but uh, if you can figure that out, that might actually work for you and also for iOS users as well. But personally, I'm going to go ahead and do what I usually do by deleting the data, okay, which is right here. So the thing is, for some players, I don't understand why this does not work. But if this does not work for you, you can go to this Google settings. It's not just settings, it's Google settings. Okay, and go to ads. Okay, go to ads reset advertising id okay and that's it and then you can go back to your game and you don't even need to click on the force uh shutdown or something like that it'll just since the data is cleared so it wouldn't go back to the game so this is uh how it is so it be greeted by the home screen so let me verify if resetting by clearing data works and for this method uh deleting data strangely it only requires you to download 15 mb of data the base game is already there there so if you, if you delete data it, it will not be actually cleared so this uh, method of deleting data is more like the, uh, clearing cache because 15 mb you know it's like close it's really small so this actually works and uh, you don't have to download the whole one gig again which is really neat this is a method that i personally would do instead because this is what i'm being used to and i could not for my life i don't know i could not figure out how to actually do the email thing so you can continue like this okay so guest account is free and you can start re-rolling okay so go to re-roll you guys probably have already figured this out but i'm just gonna do a quick one okay so according to various sources i'm i, I just 
took a lot of sources. I have not actually played this game. So from what I gathered, Silver Ash is the number one most OP broken unit in the game. Okay, he's usable everywhere. So there's no map that he cannot be used. And I'm not going to go into details like what are they for. So we don't really care when we reroll, right? So as mentioned, this game is playable even without all the six stars. The PvE is actually um, clearable via normal units just playing by normal probably there are some challenges uh in the later stage but so far that's why they say you don't actually need all the op six stars so you'll be fine i guess so if you want to start out really really strong and also to clear the stage way easier than, than most of the players like myself I'm, I'm personally not gonna get silver ash because you know, it's not a waifu. Uh, he's top of the list, followed by Exercise, the waifu with a vector. Personally, I'm not a big fan of uh, Exercise. I don't really like how she looks like. Follow up next is uh, Hoshiguma. Hoshiguma, and then we'll get Stitch, and then Shining, and then Angelina being the last. Yeah, she's actually more of a support, but she's my waifu, so I'm probably gonna stick to her or gonna stick with an account with like two six stars, and then I'll be sad. Personally, I think having two six stars uh, feels better. Hopefully, one of them will be Angelina, okay? So that's fine. Okay, so that's all for the reroll guide. I hope this actually helped you guys have a clearer understanding of how to reroll. Okay, so don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already, and if I helped you out in this video, okay? Uh, like this video if it actually helps and comment below if you are still having trouble with the re-rolling anyways uh this game is so hype and uh i believe there's a lot of youtubers that is covering this as well so be sure to check out their guides uh, i think they probably do a really good job on the on the guides in some of them actually have played the china version some of them have played in the closed beta which uh, i wasn't invited to so <laughs> so it's it's fine so i'm gonna start playing uh as of now and uh Okay, before that, I'm gonna go, gonna reroll. Okay, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Okay, so anyway, I will include this tier list, okay, from China. I'm not really sure how accurate this is, but I'm pretty sure this might help some of you. Okay, to get a clearer understanding on what are the stronger units, what are the, you know, the weaker units. Generally, I feel that the six stars are, okay, you know, like the better ones. In this tier list, although it's in Chinese, but uh, there's some English words. Importantly, their role and also their names are included. So, in the portrait, you can actually see like, who's the better ones, who's not good, not that good, okay? So you just need to know T0 is the best, followed by T1 and then T2, etc, etc. And don't forget, you have a 5 star selector tier kit uh, of, I think, 4 characters that you can choose from. I'm not gonna cover it in this video because it's a reroll guide. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.